Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Kim. I'll be here at Kim's A Little of a Lot. I hope everybody is having a wonderful day or night, wherever you may be as you are seeing this. Um, I have a kind of bit of a different video to show everybody. These cats have been going bonkers since the cat tree arrived in a box. And it's been sitting in a box for quite some time. As you can tell, the cats have pretty much tried to get into it themselves. So, yes, I already completed this step right here. If you zoom in, you see it's like a little cubby. And it's got, you know, the um, pillars. So, yes, nice beigey, like cream color. And I'm doing this myself. I will be following these directions right here. And so far, I've completed this step. So, if anybody's interested in watching me slowly put a cat tree together, well, you may not see me put it together, but you'll see section by section being completed. Okay, stick around. And I am back. As you see, Smokey would like to see what it is that I am in the process of doing. Here's the base here, and then we have the three pillars that I had just screwed in, tightened a bit with the R key. And then my next step, I realize I can't just do this step by step and take my sweet time when you have six cats up here wanting to get into everything. So swift and fast is the key for putting this together but the next step is to use this piece right here watch out Smokey and it's going to lay see I'm trying to do this with one hand but it's going to lay on top over here like this so stay tuned for that um, Tiny and Smokey, are you guys telling me that I need to take a break? Watch those screws, Smokey. Well, they're not really screws. Yeah, you can't play with it. It's, they're already bolted in underneath. But, making progress. A little on the slow slide, you know, because of this. I'll let them do their thing so they can explore for a few minutes. Ginger, what are you doing? Say, so when I first started the video, this is the piece for the cubby where Ginger, if he wants, he can go inside in the meantime, but he hasn't figured that part out yet. But yeah, slowly working. Thank you. See, as you see, there's the cubby part attached and we're making progress. As you see, they're checking it out as you know, my little inspector's here. Whoa, and he just jumps right into the box. <laughs> so yes, guys, we're making progress. We're building some height. We're building the height. I don't know, I got the ceiling fan up above there. We might have to figure out a different place to put this. We'll have to figure out what to do. All right, but we're making progress, guys. Another seat just got kind of installed, not completely, screwed screwed on. Uh, another small pillar for base. But, so this is the cat tree with a lot of room. See, they're starting to check it out a little bit as we go. Nope, we can't hop in there yet, Booba. There we go. Okay. I'll be back. I've been providing hints along the way. Realized I was making a big mistake. Do we see the difference? The tubby's already making himself at home. This right here is the correct pillar. This here was the wrong pillar. This is now stuck. And I cannot get it out, no matter how I try. So, yeah, and 
any suggestions would be greatly appreciated. However, I'm the only one here at the moment, so looks like I gotta wait for Scott to get home so he can get this out for me because it is supposed to go in, watch your head, Smokey, in here. See, it's supposed to stand up like that. And that's how it helps the thing stand up like that. Not where it sunk because I had the wrong pillar inside. Kim, live and learn. This is me. This is what happens. <laughs> but it's okay. That's why whenever I put something together, I never tighten it fully in the beginning. Um, because sometimes I make mistakes along the way. However, it wasn't my mistake this time. They had the wrong stickers on the wrong thingy. So, it wasn't my fault. <laughs> but anyway, so, slight hiccup, but... We shall be back shortly. Right, Smokey? Say bye for now. Good boy. What about you, Tubby? Tubby's like, I'm sleeping. They're just hanging. As you can see, the correct pillars are in now. And this stands up nicely. It does not sag. As you see, my helpers are still here. Guys, be good to each other. They're playing. They're already playing. Okay. I moved that out a little bit more further to the side so they have more room. And the top, well, not the top yet. The um, next layer is on. We have the pillar. And then as you see up here, we have our still working. I just completed, let's see, directions are upside down. I just completed this step. So we still have this one to go, this one to go, and this will be the completion part. So, and all that's left, besides your Allen key, is a couple of screws. And that is it. All right, so let's continue this and see how it goes. Oh, who do we have down here? Is this Miss Choo Choo? Wow, this is her first time checking this out. Okay. Okay, the top part is complete. This is as high as it's going to go. So if I back away, it's hard to walk backwards, but. It's a decent size height. It's not seven feet. I'd say it's at least six, a little over six feet. I'm five seven, so yeah. It's a nice height. Different for them. And over here, I'm hiding it at the moment. Let's see if you can see. Is a toy mice that's gonna dangle right here. And the little scutches, they've been up to something already without me knowing. There's a little hole right here. Right? You see the little hole? It's meant... Excuse the shadow. <laughs> Trying to get out of the shadow. It's meant for this little bird piece, which I cannot seem to find. And I know it was here when I took everything out of the box so somebody ran off with it so right now they are not going to have that because I don't know where to look I've been looking all over I'm still gonna keep looking but we're not done because as we can see this part is pretty much complete next we have to do this part which is basically just you know putting stuff underneath like a hammock and whatnot and then this as well so Tiny, did you steal the bird? Did you steal it? <laughs> okay, guys. This is the completed project. Um, since I last, before I stepped out, I installed the scratching post there on the bottom. Over here is a little hammock. Over here is a hammock. And then over here, there is a rope that they can dangle from. And yes, we're still looking for the toy, but this is the cat tree. 
I would recommend this for anybody. Um, the instructions are fairly easy as long as things are labeled correctly. And the funny thing is, I'm left with one screw. <laughs> and I know everything, so they must have given me an extra one just in case. But, yep. So this is the cat tree. And um, tell me what you guys think. What do you think, Tiny? Do you like your new area? It's like a little jungle gym. You can lay in your hammock right there. And you can go up in the hole, dangle on the rope, chill out in your little cubby. Still got to move this though somewhere because the ceiling fan's right above. And then as we get higher and higher, I'm going to reveal their other toy right now. And we're going to have some cats coming up. <laughs> But yeah, so this one just hangs from there. So not bad. You know, fairly simple instructions and whatnot. Um, I would just recommend, you know, if you purchase this, I had gotten this off of HSN. Um, I'll leave the link to this product if anybody is interested in checking this out. Um, I believe I spent $130 for this, which wasn't bad because, you know, I do have an HSN card, so I did divide it up into uh, flex payments. So, yeah. But guys, Tiny, what do you think of your cat tree? <laughs> what about you, Ginger? Oh, see, I told you, this is why I'm still rolling. Somebody was going to go for that bird. And it is Tiny. Tiny? Get it, Tiny. No, wrong bird. There's two birds. There's one that dangles, and then there's the one that clips in. Okay, guys. Hope you like my little demonstration here of putting together a cat tree. And um, I hope everyone has a great day, night, morning, evening, wherever you may be. And I'll see you guys around. Take care. Bye.